music with hits like Wild One and Volare and 60s teen idol and South Philly native Bobby Rydell. in the audience and everything. Now, 50 years later, Bobby's not only entertaining, but raising awareness for organ donation. Uh, you see him and eight-year-old Asaya both receive liver transplants from the same liver. They have a connection for life, and they are here to talk about it. Please welcome Bobby Rydell, Asaya, and her mother, Rashina, to the queue. <laughs> Bobby, right now, how you doing, Mike, sir? My pleasure. Thank you. 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 Thank and she was only 21 years old, got hit by a car. Wow. And immediately pronounced brain dead. And that's just how we, we shared uh, Julia's liver. Mm. Wow. Uh, and the first meeting happened uh, Christmas 2012 yeah. at the Jefferson Holiday Party, where they actually had an opportunity to see each other face to face. Yeah. Wow. How you feeling, Asai? Strong. <laughs> okay. I'm kind of nervous that I'm on here. Oh, oh, say it again? I'm kind of Nervous. She's nervous. Don't be nervous. You're just talking to an old friend. Yep. I'm just, well, like I'm really usually. old. <laughs> yeah. So, but I, I'm hearing, I'm hearing that you, uh, this is, this is your second transplant. How are you, but you're feeling, other than nervous, your energy is up? Okay. And yeah. I heard you have a, a book coming out as well. Well, she actually published, uh, yes. November. Um, she has a children's transplant book in which we've implemented a curriculum that we're bringing into the schools to educate children about solid organ donation. And she launches a livery lemonade project next month. Okay. Are you, are, and I heard you having a birthday coming up soon? In yeah. five days. Okay. We, oh, I didn't know that. Well, five yeah, days? Bobby, you gotta, you gotta give her a million dollars. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Bobby, I know you, you also have a book as well. Yeah, yeah. Uh, basically, that's how I, I got my liver because... Uh, Back in 2003, my first wife passed away, and we were married for 36 years. Wow. And uh, and after she went, I I couldn't handle it, and I and I turned to the bottle, you know, yeah. and I started drinking heavily, became an alcoholic, and uh, and uh, and uh, I mean the way that everything happened, Quincy, was just a miracle, because I was just about ready to you know to leave this earth, you know, and my wife, I this was July the eighth. Mm. I said, we better get all the papers together and ready. She said, oh, don't worry, you'll be all right, you'll be all right. And I might think, nah. The next day we got a call from Jeff. He said, get your body over here. Wow. And within about three and a half hours, I was in surgery. And uh, the surgery took the better part of 20-some-odd uh, hours. Mm -hmm. Got a new liver and a new kidney yeah. from, from the, the same, same donor. donor. Wow. From the same donor, Julia. So when I do my shows now, I try to impress upon the, the, the people how important it is to become an organ donor. Mm -hmm. And the next time you go and, you know, for your new license, as a favor to me, would you please become an organ donor? Check because it box. truly is the gift of life. I mean, look at her. Four years old, when she got liver, she's now eight years old. Wow. And, 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 and she's got days. her whole life ahead of her. You know, a healthy That's life. Isn't that great? Mm -hmm. yeah. Right, honey? How is, how is the connection being with Asaya? How, how has Asaya kind of changed your, you know, your new research? Well, I figured, you know, look, I'm, I just turned 75. I'm, I'm, uh, last month's... <laughs> last month, thank you. Uh, I didn't think I was going to make it to 70, tell you the yeah. truth, you know, but uh, I, I kind of look at it this way, Quincy. Uh, she's uh, going to be nine years old, you know. I figured... If, if I make it, you know, fine, all well and good, you know, with the new liver, you never know what's going to happen. It's been five years now. It'll be five years in July. But I'm more or less, you know, I live my life. I had a good life. And yes. if, it, if it came to the point where it was over, I could accept that. 
She's nine years old. Gotcha. She's and got her whole life ahead of her. So I'm God here, bless. Huh? I'm hearing tonight this uh, the sixth annual president's uh, reception tonight. At the Gift of Life House, yes. yeah. You guys will, will be there? Yeah, oh, absolutely. Will yeah. you be there? Yes. And you guys will be doing something special, right? What will you guys be doing? Well, the first um, ever. Gift of Life jingle. Can we hear the jingle? I think I got it. Let me yeah. see. Let's see what we get. Yeah. I was just, uh, I was just drafted by the birds. I can tell. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Water boy. <laughs> okay, let's hear this jingle. Right? When do I start? Huh? Are you ready? One, two, three. Come take the clouds away. Brighten up the day. We don't have much to say. Give the gift of life. Oh, let's give it up for Bobby Rydell. Soon to be nine-year-old Asire, Mother Washina. Thank you for coming to the queue. It's a pleasure. Thanks we for having us, Quincy. Thank you all.